Yo, what up guys? Welcome back to Resident Evil 4 VR. We're gonna just hop into the shooting range really quick to see if there's anything new. Uh, but if you missed the last episode, we're currently making our way through the island. The island itself is full of deadly creatures. And well, it's no stranger to us. We've been taking them all out. I'm just here to see if there's any that we need to do. Yeah, we're done. We're done with the firing range. We've collected all the bottle caps along this journey. They're all very, very cool. I'm glad to have that collection completed. We're going to go ahead and continue. We're at the tail end of the island now. We're going to be fighting uh, Krauser here. So we're, we're almost at the end of the game. We're very close to the end of the game at this point. I wonder if this section is going to be done a little bit different. Probably not. I'm just going to run for it because, well, there's no point in shooting him or anything right now. We can't do anything to him. Ah, uh, he's trying to hit me. Are you kidding me? We just have to sit here and wait for a countdown timer on the door? That's, that's strange. If we did have to wait before, I don't think it was that long. Ooh, magnum rounds. That'll come in handy. Should we use the magnum against him in the final... Holy shit, that actually scared me just then. <laughs> I did not expect him to jump out of the corner and try to slice my throat. He's being a bad boy slicing. We had to kick him. He's chasing us. I don't like it. He better stop. You better stop. Is that the piece just sitting over there? We don't even have to do this puzzle here? Maybe that's because we're on easy mode. Now, that is really weird that... That's just how it goes. What do you intend to do with storing our breath? To bring order. Oh. Ow. Maybe we're just supposed to inflict damage at this point. Don't just stand there. Come out and fight like a man. I'm not falling for that one. Just trying to have fun. Oh, there's a lever right there. I don't think we can hit it through this. No. So I just slicing them. I remember when I played this game on the hardest difficulty and um, I had to just slice him. <laughs> like bullets and magnums and rockets. Nothing did a single drop of damage to the boy. So I just had to sit there with my knife and knife him. That was like a legitimate 
a legitimate thing that you had to do. A legitimate, legitimate mint. Yes, I like mints. TMP. I'm not gonna lie. This. Uh, oh shit, dude. You know what? Holy crap, Krauser. Jeez, oh man. This reminds me of Metal Gear Solid. <laughs> These little bots that they got going on here. Krauser's bots. Now we go and fight him. I don't really want to use my Magnum, but I mean, I guess I could. That's, I mean, that's the point of getting it, right? Is to use it. We got tons of ammo for it, and this is really like one of the last big boss fights. Let's add our grenade. Which we actually don't have many grenades. <laughs> Look at all this healing we have. This is nice. All right. We're good. So the piece is going to be right over here. And then the boss fight begins. I don't want to. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. Please, Krauser, please. Uh, that was really weird. Oh, the Magnum is good. Killer 7, nice. Put that back in my holster. There we go. We have three minutes to get out of here, which means... Oh, Magnum ammo right there. Sweet. Health is full. All right. Nice. That Magnum was actually quite beastly. That's the point of it, you know? Like, the Magnum, that's one of those special weapons that you want to use sparingly. Because you don't get that much ammo. I know it seems like I might have a lot of ammo right here, but this is basically what you get. And if you use it, well, that's it. You don't get any more. All right, let's do this next section. So we're getting really close to the end now. I might be able to finish it here on this episode. Hold the skip.
Good shot. Good shot, dude. Nice. Nice. He's kicking ass, guys. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah. Good thing we got the shotgun upgraded all the way. There we go. Oh, crap. Just keep moving. That was bad luck at this top of the stairs. Wow, that was weird. I bought the armor specifically for this part here. Because <laughs> there's just so much going on. I don't want to accidentally get, like... Bombarded. By some bullies. Uh-oh. Keep moving, keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. This is um, so cool to like be able to view these different things in a different way. Like, holy crap, dude, you're zooming. Like all these different levels that we're playing right now, it's so cool to see it um, in, in first person. And of course in VR, like we're playing it so differently. It might not seem... Like, that big of a deal, maybe if you're just viewing it at home, but trust me, I'm, I'm telling you, it is so damn cool. Like, this this game is the only reason I bought a Quest uh, Oculus headset. You know, we're just going to go ahead and ignore you. We're not going to ignore them bullets down there. TMP. All right, now it's time for this part. Oh, my God. I wish I could pick up that dude's RPG. 
That would be amazing. Of course he's wearing body armor. Nice. We'll go ahead and pull this lever here. And then we got to pull... Oh, shit. I forgot about that guy. I don't want to use that just yet. Oh my god. I might have to use it. Jesus. Okay. I thought that guy was going to try to get on the... The uh, turret there, but he didn't. Grab the ammo. We'll go ahead and keep going through. To the cliffside ruins. Ah, oh, crap. Sadler, we'll get you. Don't you worry about that. Don't worry one bit, buddy. Because we're coming for you. We might even magnum you in the eyeball. I think that would be pretty satisfying if you ask me. Oh, no. Mike! <laughs> Alright, let's get this show on the road, baby. I really do thank each and every one of you for coming out and uh, watching my very first VR Let's Play thingy mabobber. Um, I really, really appreciate it because this is a lot of fun. I'm, I might, you know, integrate more VR, uh, in general when it comes to this channel. I mean, we might as well. We have access to it. We have it. All right. More Magnum ammo. We have a regenerator in here, so I'm going to go ahead and bring out the thermal. Bringing out the thermal. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and reload this really quick. That way we could free up some more space in our case. Put that back on there. We got lots of TMP ammo. Dude is creepy. There we go. We got your ass, dude. We got your number on speed dial, boy.
Oh, so creepy. So creepy. It's like a bunch of intestines, like, sitting in there. So creepy. All right, let's continue our mission. Oh, forgot we got to go to the side. There we go, to the security checkpoint. I'm actually going to keep the sniper out for this part because this part can get pretty crazy too. Come on, big boy. Whoa, he's shooting his own guys. I didn't even know you could do you can have him do that. That's so cool. This dude is strong. I shot him right in the head with a sniper. There we go. Grab that, grab that. Oh, thank goodness I could grab that. I didn't know if I'd be able to. All right, I'm gonna pull out the shotgun because there's no more big guys. And I don't think we fight any more regenerators. Oh man. You would be a scary bastard. Holy moly. I love the fact that I can move and like shoot and stuff at the same time and dodge their attacks. That makes like this entire situation so much more enjoyable. Of course you're wearing armor. Why not? Okay. Go back and press that other button. And we get on through. Oh my god, dude. You... You scared the actual shit out of me. <laughs> I am not even kidding. <laughs> I was not expecting those guys to be there.
I probably should have, but I was not. <laughs> oh, that was actually scary. Hundred and twenty one thousand points, dude. Or hundred and twenty three thousand. It's not bad. Get some upgrades right before we head on in to fight the boss. Probably upgrade the Magnum to be honest with you. Because we do get a rocket launcher in that final fight, but, I mean, why not? I guess the one benefit to having like a hundred rounds on the striker is we wouldn't really have to reload and we would actually free up a lot of space uh, within our inventory if we were just picking up, you know, a bunch of ammo or whatever. All right, guys, um, I'm pretty sure this is it. We're coming down to some of the final... Uh, Minutes of the game here. They're loading us up with cash for upgrades. We have some stuff to sell. I think I'm just going to sell the stuff that I got. Because I missed out on the cat's eye in the beginning of the game. Oh, wait, I already sold that. Never mind. <laughs> um, whatever, I'll just sell this too. I don't care. We have 181000 to spend. Let's tune up the Magnum. Let's just make it super powerful. Is that all, stranger? Look at that. Very stable. Very powerful. 148,000 for that. Um, I don't know if we have enough to do this. No. Alright. I think we are ready for the final boss fight. Let's go ahead and put on our Magnum with 14 rounds. We'll go ahead and uh, increase our health. Why not? I mean, look at all this healing stuff we have. We have a ridiculous amount of healing items. We'll just add this to our consumable and... Uh, yeah. We're ready to rock, man. We are ready to rock. I think I'm going to put Flashbang on. All right. We're almost to the end. I uh, miscalculated where we were. But at least we got the Magnum upgraded all the way. Let's put our pistol back on. <laughs> Just for the time being. Don't want to use my Magnum ammo on these regular guys. What were they going to do to her? They were going to kick her, dude. They were going to kick her in the titties. Ooh, big button. I'm just kidding. <laughs> That'd be funny, though, if you could press it. 
But uh, I, I firmly believe that they were going to kick her in the titties. So I'm going on record saying that. All right. What were they going to do to her? I don't know. <laughs> We are very, very close now to having max health. I think I think we only need one more. So we missed one yellow throughout the entire playthrough. Here it is. The final game. The final. We don't have enough stuff to sell. We took care of all that. So let's go on. Let's go to the end here. With the big old boss boy. Oh shoot, I forgot to put on my magnum. Locking down elevator. Oh my god! He's right in front of me. Put that on. I'm gonna put the TMP on. Actually, I'm gonna put the. I'm gonna put the TMP on because I'm out of shotgun. Oh, and there's more shotguns right here. Oh my god. Was not expecting that. Oh, can I shoot his eye from here? Shit, I totally miss I totally like messed that up. Come on. Come on over here, dude. I'm gonna get you. Damn, dude. This thing's got to be doing a ton of damage to him. We got lots of bullets to shoot. Holy crap. I'm going to put on a regular grenade. Dude, climb. <laughs> I was doing it for a hot minute. Oh my god, he's right in front of us. That is not fair. That is not fair. Boy, that is not fair. I'm putting a grenade on. Because once he's weakened enough, Ada's going to throw us a... Uh... Ada will throw us a launcher. Oh my gosh, again? I'm choosing the worst times to take this thing. I gotta switch up my grenades. Might as well do it now because he's gonna jump right in front of me during the cutscene. Headset power low. Oh gosh, what a bad time for the headset to go low. Shooting him in the eye from over here. There we go. Use this. Nice. 
the inventory really you're gonna get on me about the inventory so now I'm in a mad rush to manage my inventory at the worst possible time fucking just get out Hasta luego. This thing looks really cool. Alright, so the boss is dead. Give me the money. Give me the money. Oh my gosh, give me the money. <laughs> it wasn't giving it to me. Oh my gosh. I'm like literally racing against the time because of the headset. Oh, we're right here at the end. If there's any cutscenes, we have to skip them. We have to skip all if possible. Holy moly. Oh, gosh. Come on, come on, come on. Skip it. Oh, this is so crazy. We're almost there. We are almost there. I don't even know if there's enemies at this part. I forget. Oh my gosh. Oh, f I forgot. Ashley can't jump down ladders. Uh, Where are you, going? you should have said that sooner, Ashley. I don't even know how this freaking thing is going to ride. I feel like I'm going to fail it the first time because there's probably going to have to be like throttle usage and. Hang on, sweetheart. <laughs> what a weird thing to say. Oh, shoot. So I actually turn it. Oh, man. The, this, this is motion sickness right here, dude. This is it. Oh, my shit. I feel like I'm going to fall over. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, we can make it. Yes. Yes. Yes, we did it. We did it. Yes, I died a bunch, but we did it. Yes. I'm so happy. Guys, thank you all so much for watching this playthrough. Wow, they allow that, but they won't let her say pervert? Okay. <laughs> That's really weird. Wow. Well, guys, that's it. Thank you so much for watching. I truly appreciate y'all watching and, uh, you know, checking out the series of my first VR playthrough. I think it went fairly well. I'm a little emotional, you know. Resident Evil 4 is one of my favorite games of all time, so. I'm just sad that the easy mode, like, cut out certain portions of the game. It wasn't many, but it was, like, really weird ones that I don't think needed to be cut out. But anyway, that's it. Thank you guys so much once again. Check out the entire playlist linked in the description below, and I will catch you all on the next video. See ya!